Last night, I never been asleep, you know, I get a call. My phone is ring, 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 but I'm not asleep dead. My girl is not asleep dead. And my mother live a Spanish town, my family live a Spanish town still. I'm a day, I'm in, I'm in a sleep dead. I'm in a sleep. If I pin drop, me can't hear it. So I meet, meet my phone, I ring, 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 ring. I say, I walk on my phone, I walk on my phone. And I call, I answer, and I say, Angel, Angel, Angel. Go on over Instagram, go on over Instagram. Elephant over there. And Mataran. Blessed day, my people. So in today's video, we're going to talk about female dancehall artist D'Angel addressing Elephant Man and Tony Mataran. Now, recently, them did up on Instagram Live and they talk about best female dancehall artists who can perform and them thing. They're the best performers, them. D'Angel name never get mentioned. The fans, them, must say that's a no man, owner for leave out D'Angel and this and that. So she basically addresses the situation. People are fighting against her. And one only part thing D'Angel have to talk on, you definitely need to stick around for you hear what the first lady of dancehall have to say. Is it. Also, we're going to talk about a popular American footballer named O.J. Simpson who passed away at the age of 76. So, may I give you some more information on that? Also, we're going to talk about a woman who got rid of her husband, her baby, and then get rid of herself because some rumors that surfaced the other day um, as it relates to the eclipse. Said so the world did not come to an end or something like that. And apparently, she believed the rumors them and that caused her to do what she do. Is it? So, may I give you no more information on that. Also, we're going to talk about Selector Footer Hype responding after he recently got some threats because him come out and burn a fire upon Idonia. So, we're going to actually play the video and we're going to talk about it a little bit. Is it? Also, we're going to talk about World Dog dissing Footer Hype and calling him a batty cop. <laughs> Oh boy. Also, we're going to talk about a man who was kind up and taken out weeks before his wedding. Very sad situation, my people. So before we go no further into the topics, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Also, head over to my Instagram page, Mix Up Time 4, but I definitely appreciate that. All right, people. So the first thing we're going to talk about is the first lady of dance, D'Angel. Now, D'Angel went live earlier, Zine, and as I said, she addressed Tony Mataran, she addressed Elephant Man, because they recently went live and they were talking about, like, female entertainers we can perform female dancehall artists you understand so the angel name was not mentioned but according to the first lady of dancehall she is one of if not the best female dancehall artist when it comes to performing. Yes, you are my people. And of course, you know the angel can do her thing. Not sure if people will agree that she is the best or even in the top five. But it's like when them call. I don't even remember one who them they put in at the list. I think Spice name in it. One of the time in the year they matter about Jada Kingdom. If I try remember correctly. But you don't know said angel name never in it and thing. But the fans them, it seemed like them did a... Tell Mataran them say yo, oh you feel left out um Angel, Angel shell down sting this and that and all kind of things and you know them tag her every night she watch the video or she go up on the live or whatever and you know apparently somebody that called on her phone as well that I wish she say. Anyway, she come and she address it now and she feel some type of way my people. So let me get to this video. Only can tell me if you not agree with what the angel is saying. You see my people. So yeah, listen to this. Last night me never been asleep, you know, I'm get a call. Like my phone are ring, 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 but I'm not sleep dead. My girl is not sleep dead. And my mother lives a Spanish town. My family lives a Spanish town still. And I'm there, I'm, I'm not sleep dead. I'm not sleep. If I pin drop, I can't hear it. So I meet, meet my phone are ring, 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 ring. And I say, I walk on my phone. I walk on my phone. And I call, I answer. And I say, Angel, Angel, Angel. Go on over Instagram. Go on over Instagram. Elephant over there. And Mataran. I'm a talk boy, I'm a talk boy, so I said talk boy, me? I said, I said, yeah, elephant over there, I'm a, 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 a Tony Mataran. And they say, the, 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 the top five, but it's performing female artists. And them call, who they, who they want to call, and close it off and say, I hit that. And the fans them say, I don't hit that, you know? The angel, the fans them say, I don't hit that. The angel, the angel, the angel, that the fans them say, I don't hit that. What am to the angel? You understand me I say? Cause they narrow down and pick out baddest performers on stage and baddest artists, female artists are rare. So them I say then roll on them. The fans them come out strong, cause I close off already and done them no member me, them part me one side long time. They me never come to them radar. And my fans them now take it up on them head and say, no man. The angel man, what to the angel, what me back man, what me talk back man, the angel in a that man, the angel are one of the baddest performers. Out there right now, I shall hold it long, 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 long time. Look how me devastate Sting. Sting was just gone December. Me in my top three best performer. Sting was just gone December, you know, but you know, free to acknowledge me as somebody where I do music for uh, 17 years. Me, I want out, you know. 
a 17 long years, me there, I me a roll out, I me a do the work, I me a perform, I me a kill the show them, I me a mash up the show them, I me a do the things them say, you don't see me none at all. But they don't see me none at all. But they don't quickly say people are fighting the out and people are back food out on the mouth and people don't want to know yam bread. So hold on. So that's about me. So <clears throat> now back food out of my mouth and don't want me yam bread. So my basket and my plate, they dry and empty like desert. So if you can seek my food in desolate places, why don't you call my name in the mouth? Something wrong? If you don't call my name, they're going to blacklist you know? If you don't call my name, they're going to back food out on the mouth? Eh? If you don't call me name on the family, I go dead if you're hungry. What go up if you don't call me name? What go up if you don't, if you don't just acknowledge me and give me flowers and say, the angel? Where are the fans them wish me really thank you? Know? I big up, I love my fans them, I love my fans them, I love you, know? I love you, I love you. Know? Why are you take my fans them if you say, no, no can't lock off that angel name no call it. Oh, you can't lock off that angel name no call it. Because angel is one of the baddest performers them right now in the music. 17 years, but there so a fight in the music. We could have gone anywhere else, we could have gone because we could have leave America too, you know. We could have leave America too, but we still here. I mean, I fight for what is mine because if I can't dance, I can't dance abroad. I mean, still here. I mean, I fight back of you because I'm gonna show this and I'm gonna win in front of you. Yeah, you know, take out my name out of you, you know, go plant my name, you know, you know, go take you up, you know, go dig you up, you know, go take me out top, walk for me. Stop walk for me, all I want. So I want to work and I'm a come here. Where fighter come from, Father God? Want to do one, Father God, expose them. I'm not gonna take my name. I'm not realize I'm not carrying my name. I'm not walk for my name. I'm not gonna look blessed. Because I'm a God, I'm saying I'm pure. I'm not realize I'm not walk for me and carry me to bury me all about and do the things them. Eh? And carry me gonna obey man and obey. I'm not realize. Say I bless me, look bless more. I'm not realize. When I say, oh, she looks so, oh, we can't get rid of her because we have purpose. We don't want to get rid of talent for me not try to get rid of nobody at all. Awa, awa, awa. Eh? Nothing not fit me. But I'm um, blessed, um, 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 bookings of money not fit me. I'm not going to fit. Yeah, man, so big up yourself, the angel. One thing I know is she's definitely a persistent dancehall artist because at the end of the day, she didn't really get the breakthrough yet, but that don't stop her from doing what she had do. And during this same live, she make it be known, say, yo, she not go do certain things for boss. She go kind of just stick to what she had do. You understand what I mean? Say, either you love her with what she had do, or you don't like her none at all because she's not going to, you know, do certain low things for get ahead in life, basically. So maybe in a later video, I tomorrow or some other time I'll we'll play them other little parts there but she had a lot to say my people and you can obviously tell that you feel aware that her name was not mentioned in relation to the top five best female dancehall artists in, in relation to performance you understand my people not even hot song you know because you have artists who can perform good and them not really have whole heap of hot songs and you have artists who have a bag of hot song and them can perform so you don't know the thing go. anyway my people let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section so the next thing we're going to talk about is a very sad story when we see on the internet in relation to a woman who got rid of her husband our youth and also herself because she think the world did going to come to her end you see my people well if things even somebody woman know i tell me say be things are going to go on when the eclipse come on one bag of thing and yo <laughs> oh boy anyway let me get to this article when you can tell me when you think about this in the comment section is it and of course me i forgot to change up some of the words then because you don't know youtube sensitive anyway so this is what the story i say mother got rid of her boyfriend so it's not her husband people my bad Anyway, mother got rid of her boyfriend, her baby, and then herself after the eclipse fueled the end of the world. Thoughts? The distressing sequence of events shook several Los Angeles neighborhoods when Daniel Johnson, known in the online astrology community as Daniel Ayoka, spiraled into a deadly rampage fueled by her apocalyptic fears. Johnson, who had amassed a following of 106,000 under her alias, had been vocal about her end-of-world anxieties, especially concerning an impending 
ending eclipse she believed would trigger catastrophic change. Just days before the tragic incident, Jan's ominous message escalated on social media. She implored her followers to brace for the apocalypse, suggesting that the eclipse marked a critical juncture for spiritual alignment and choice. Her alarming post culminated in a tweet urging her audience to acknowledge the power of choice in the face of looming spiritual warfare, a message that resonated widely online. Wake up, wake up, the apocalypse is here. Everyone who have ears listen, your time to choose what you believe is now. She wrote an ex prayer to the incident. However, the online persona of Johnson as a divine healer and astrology influencer contrasted starkly with the horrifying reality that unfolded. As per reports, early Monday, she committed the atrocious act of getting rid of her boyfriend Jalen Allen Chani in their Woodland Hills apartment. The situation escalated rapidly. Johnson, driving at perilous speed, subsequently attempted to get rid of her daughters, resulting in the taking out of the infant child and narrowly missing the other one or the other. The sequence of events unraveled further as investigators piece together Johnson's action from the crime scene to the fatal crash. The apartment bore the iron marks of the incident with B-L-O-O-D-Y footprints, tarot cards and black feathers scattered throughout, suggesting a chaotic and disturbed state of mind. Johnson's trajectory from a celebrated clairvoyant, once lauded by a media outlet for her insight into astrology, to a perpetrator of such a brutal series of acts has left many bewildered. Her final acts interpreted by some as driven by misguided belief in an impending apocalypse underline a tragic narrative where fear overwhelms reason, leading to irreparable loss and devastation. So that's what's going on, my people. As I say, very sad situation. You know, me say people in general are talking about what going happen with the eclipse were gone and this are going happen and you know, I'm going to be honest with you know, my people. I never believe anything. Not saying that it couldn't possibly happen, you know, Zine, but I just not believe it. I remember one time we did hear about some Nostradamus guy where did predicts that the world that will come to an end or something like that. And, you know, <laughs> oh boy. Anyway, let me know anything about this in the comment section and we just gonna move on to the next topic. So Selector Footer Hype is responding to some people who basically are sending some threats, right? And this is after Footer Hype recently came out and unfollow Idonia plus him. Um, this I don't know, I never call him name, but we know I don't name attack because he made a post after the photo surfaced with Jeffrey and I don't know, you see it, footer hyped up about, you know, do the people around Jamaica and this and that and one bag of thing. But on top of that, him did have a photo with I don't know, big him up on him, Earth Strong, and him removed the photo off him Instagram page, him and follow him all of that zine. So, you don't know, it seemed like some of the people, him, you know, take it up on them hands and, you know, it seemed like them are saying footer hype, some threatening words and things. So, the selector is now hitting back, basically, and make them know, say, yo, him prepare for anything, you see it, anything, any way they want to take it, him can take it. So I guess Uno can, you know, um, summarize a little talk that however Uno want to summarize it, but seem like Futa prepare for anything. Let me get to this video right now, and as usual, my people, Uno can tell more anything. Mm. Do not feel like say. Uno can tell me where for bonfire say. And Uno member good. Don't forget it now. Say, a footer hype on a deal with. When you can't frighten me, when you can't intimidate me, nobody around when you can't frighten me, no man, no girl, no boy, no family, no friend can't frighten me. I'm not afraid of no boy, no girl, no man, no Dan, no second, no third, no fourth, no i I'm not afraid of no boy. You hear that? Remember good of me. On a deal with you, yeah? So when you shit up on yourself, don't feel like say, nobody can talk to me and tell me not burn my fire as me tell you I'm prepared for whatever. And when you remember good at me, we don't have to spell it out, you know, you know. So any level you don't want to take it to, take it to. Yeah, man. So that's what the selector for say. You know, at the end of the day, still, you know, footer hype is a man where I go burn certain fire. But I you know people just know, say, a footer hype that even if you don't agree with him, you have to just know, say, I saw him stay. If he says something and him not like it, he's going to speak on it. So you just either have to just allow him make him speak where he must say, or you just, I don't know. The best thing I can say is people for just ignore him because you know, send certain talks to him and maybe I DM him certain things. 
that not going to really scare him. You understand? Because man don't make it clear, say, him not going to stop burn out certain things. You yes, see it? I wouldn't come out and say, yo, I'm going to stop listening to Valiant songs because he's going to perform a J. Frey party. Remember, Futa Hype delete the whole of Valiant songs them half I'm laptop, you know, people. Every single song, you know. You understand? I'm going to people, so I don't know. If, 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 you know, that was the right choice, because me personally wouldn't do that because Valiant got performed there. So, but you can't tell a man where for do, you know, a theme belief and a theme thing, is it? So, I don't know if Futa Hyper got delete the whole of Idonia song them. I don't see him take it to that level. Eh? We only see him just go to so and unfollow him and delete the photo. But anyway, my people, let me know anything about this in the comment section, is it? And since we're talking about Futa Hype, <laughs> Facebook hero, or as some people call him World Dog, they depend on Instagram Live, or Instagram or TikTok, one of them platforms there. And him basically had this up Futa Hype, I call him a body cap. You understand me and say, I say, yo, anything we have to do with the runner back, Futa Hype always has speak on it. And the other day, Futa Hype even address that where people are calling him that. Futa say, Anybody will have a problem with him or have a problem with him or burn the fire, then that means that them actually support the do the community or whatever it may be, is it? But I could get to that video here with World Dog Noma people and as usual, Uno can tell me what you think. You know what I mean? Always a wonder say footer hype. Always a do investigation pam. But always a wonder why him always a do FBI work pam. Pull up the song, your bad song, you. Yeah, my people, and of course, you know, don't know, say, World Dog and Foot and no deal again. Them used to be cool at one point in time. But we're so, um, World Dog up on TikTok and he must accept Lion, um, from Quiet Perry. And you know, people have it to say Quiet Perry this and that. No, I don't know if that's true. You never see him, I do nothing yet. Me just know, say, people are always the same this and that. And you don't know, World Dog up on TikTok or play games with them and all of that. So, you know, people are blazing fire upon him, and of course, Futa Hype, I think, did come live and I talk about man over there play with whatever, whatever. You see, it he might not call name, but you know, you know, you can tell when he talk about a specific person. So, him and World Dog is no longer friends, so World Dog, you know, I style him up and thing. Is it? Anyway, my people, let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section. So, the next thing we're gonna talk about is a man who was kind up and taken out weeks before his wedding. Is it, my people? So, let me get to this article. Only can tell me anything about this in the comment section, alright? So, it's a man kind up and taken out weeks before his wedding on Monday. Canadian Angela and her Jamaican fiancé Robert Wilson were supposed to pick up her best friend Kelly, who was supposed to be her maid of honor at the couple's wedding in Morant Bay, St. Thomas this Friday. Angela was not only looking forward to exchange wedding vows with Wilson, the love of her life, but her thoughts were also on two days later. Sunday, when as newlyweds, they would be off on a romantic honeymoon getaway, which would coincide with her 46. Unfortunately, Angela is concerned with grief as she is now making funeral arrangements for Wilson who was carned up and taken out on March 20th. It is hard being in Jamaica but at the same time I feel so much closer to him when I am here. Imagine he is going to be buried in his wedding outfit. It just doesn't make any sense to me, said the weeping Angela. According to the police report, Wilson was carned up alongside Retirement Road in Kingston by unknown assailants. He was rushed to the hospital where he was pronounced. Angela said she met Wilson, a security officer via TikTok in 2022 over and over time their friendship turned into a love affair. He sent me a DM, direct message on Instagram, but it took me about a month before I saw it. I responded and we just started talking and that's how our love started, said Angela. What I love about him was that he didn't change and he was the same person that I fell in love with online. I met him in person about five months later and he was the same person who treated and talked to me with respect. On that same trip to Jamaica, Wilson proposed to Angela on a beach in Ocho Rios. He was talking to security guards and I thought we were in trouble, but the whole time he was planning the proposal recalled Angela. When he came back to me, he told me to close my eyes and when I did, he was down on one knee and he told me he loved me and he wanted to be with me for the rest of his life. He just asked me to marry him and I said yes. I started crying because I know he was the one for me. 
I was in love with him and, you know, he was very mature. He wasn't the type who wanted anything from her. He worked very hard and he was a provider. She called him an old soul because he was so, so mature, said Angela. We were planning to buy a house and start a business. I wanted to bring him to Canada and and he was going to work and we could save to, to just build our life. We didn't have any plans of having any more children as both of us had grown kids and I have a couple of grandchildren. We were just going to enjoy life and just be a blended family. Angela said that on the morning her fiancé was taken out, she knew something was off when he did not respond to any, any of her messages. Her heart skipped a beat when she saw an incoming call from one of his sister, but nothing could have prepared her for the news. When she told me he was kind up, I just started screaming and I just kept shouting that this cannot be happening. At the time, I didn't know he had passed away. He was just stationed in Kingston at a location and had just let, left his job when he was taken out. She said, as she mourns Wilson, Angela find it a bit comfort on TikTok, the platform on which they met. She continues to share episodes of their love story, sometimes break down in tears. I am sad, devastated, angry and heartbroken. My heart is ripped into a million pieces and laying on the ground and I don't know how to start picking it up. My brain feels much sometimes and there are times when I am still in denial as he should be here with me angela added or added angela so yeah my people very unfortunate situation i don't know as my reader article here may i wonder if i just somebody bad mind him because you know he might go get married and could have soon cut out of the place isn't me god canada go live with him wife and them thing there yo you have to think all kind of ways you know i don't know me does feel like a somebody bad mind the brother yeah yes it boy oh boy I mean, I say I'm innocent enough people, I just want to make that clear because I don't know him personally. But my first thought is that a bad mind is somebody bad mind him. I am having him, you know, him woman, him whitey, and whatever, whatever things are going to go on, female thing. Anyway, let me know anything about this in the comment section, is it? So, the next thing we're going to talk about is popular American footballer OJ Simpson who passed away at age 76. So, this is what the article is saying. O.J. Simpson passed away at age 76 after cancer battle. O.J. Simpson, the decorated football superstar and Hollywood actor who was acquitted of charges he took out his former wife and her friend, but later found liable in separate civil trial, has passed away. He was 76. The family announced on Simpson's official ex account, formerly Twitter, that Simpson passed away Wednesday after battling cancer. Simpson attorney confirmed to TNZ, TMZ he passed away in Las Vegas. Simpson earned fame for and adulation through football and show business, but his legacy was forever changed by the June 1994 knife slayings of his ex-wife, Nicole Brown Simpson, and her friend, Ronald Goldman, in Los Angeles. So yes, my people, I'm not read out the full article. I'm just there for me to know what's going on. In relation to O.J. Simpson, yes, it um, passed away from cancer and things, so that's how I'm going to know, yes, it. Anyway, thanks for watching the video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Respect to everybody who watched the video. And please head over to my Instagram page, MixUpTime4. I'm out.